Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. My name is Jalal Ahmed, and in this tutorial, we are going to learn the border image property of CSS3. So this is uh, given as a uh, demo, and we will make such a um, border um, around this div. So for that purpose, I have created uh, this file, and uh, there is nothing when I click the save and I refresh. So everything is gone. So for that purpose, we are going to style it in here. Style, tag opens. So this is nothing but a simple div and is made as center, uh, enclosed uh, in center tag. So there is an H1 tag that is CSS3 border image and you can see it in here. So this is located in a div which is located in a center tag. So for that purpose, we are going to style this div in here, the head tag. So div we are width equal to giving width equal to uh, 800 pixels and height equal to 500 pixels. So let's do it according to the standards. Okay and uh, background is equal to dark sea green so click refresh and we are having our div so now we are going to assign the border image property so let me tell something before we go ahead so these are some properties border image which is the shorthand for these three properties border image source border image slice and border image repeat and we can use these properties as individual as well and um, in addition to these three properties we can use individually the border image width property and the border image outset property so first of all let me tell you how we can use the border image source what border image source will do just a minute okay border image source just track the property of just tracks the uh, image so i am having the image as uh, i am not having a proper image right now so for that purpose i am using this image okay forgive me about everything you want to tell about this image but I'm just using it for the uh, tutorial pur purpose okay border image source will take the property of uh, the URL of the image so in here we are going to uh, use the URL EF so what is the name we are copying it okay jpg so click the refresh nothing is happening okay no problem url vfcc0 now border image so i think we are forgetting something border image source uh, will not work uh, unless and until we uh, don't use the border property we have to assign the border property so for that purpose uh, let me 30 pixels and uh, solid and let make it as transparent And now check it refresh and you can see the border image and uh, the border image uh, URL it has been taken by the border image source and now we are going to go ahead so the border image source and now the slice this means how we will slice uh, the border image 
so if i it takes a numeric value if i give 30 what will happen you can see if i use 10 you can play with it as you wish and if i use the 100 you can see what's happening okay border image slice now border image slice and now the repeat so repeat takes three kinds of values one is repeat another one is uh, round and another one is stretch so we will try these three values for the demo so when i uh, use the repeat so what's happening you can see the repeat the this image has uh, these pixels on the this corner so it uh, s the these pixels remains at this corner and uh, uh, pixels of the right corner of the top right corner remain on the top right corner and uh, similarly the bottom uh, corners remain at the left right and as it is in the uh, border image i think you will uh, you will understand when i take you to the next value repeat and uh, now the round so what happens in the round you can notice this part of the image and when i click refresh you can notice the whole part is round so uh, the the let me show you the image you can see this part of the uh, image it stays in here also it disappears uh, behind the div but it stays at there and this part remains at in there but uh, some part of the image um, stays behind the div and similarly the bottom left right is as well as in the image okay so you can notice the sorry you can notice when i use 200 and click so 800 and 100 when i use this one it becomes like that so uh, and while repeat pro while repeat value this part were like this so you can notice the change which is clear i want you to make understand but repeat repeat you will now notice the change you can notice the clear change okay repeat and now stretch stretch its name tells us that it will stretch the border images as you can see that okay so this is uh, about the border image repeat and now border image width so it will give us the width it will take pixels value percentage values and em values so let we um, give it uh, percentage values uh, let me give us uh, give it uh, a 40 pixels now you can see it from here under the border box it uh, uh, under the border box it uh, it goes uh, inside the border uh, inside the border of the div so when i give uh, 60 pixels so it will not go out and it will come inside the 60 pixels will come inside more and more that this div will this color will give decreases and if i use the um, 30 pixels so it will come to a normal as it is okay similarly if i use 10 pixels what will happen you can see uh, it goes towards the border but inside the border box okay so this property border image outfit what it do what it does is uh, it is uh, opposite uh, it works opposite to the image width it goes beyond the border box and let me use 60 pixels okay so you can notice this border this is the border box and it goes beyond the border box 
this is the 30 pixels border which i used before at, at the start of the tutorial and this is the 30 pixels extra which i use in uh, here 60 so okay now we are uh, going to use a shorthand property let me delete all this but do remember that without border it will not work unless and until you uh, don't use the border property this property okay now let me use the shorthand property border image okay border image will take three uh, values that is the url of the image so vf uh, what's 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 the name where is the folder okay copy this name paste it in here and everything is fine now okay click finish click a refresh and same is the case which i use individually the border image source property okay now after this we will use the slice property a border image slice property so if i use 130 uh, so what will happen so you can see 30 uh, we slice the image according to the 30 value so when i use the repeat property so we can use the round what will happen is will happen in a round and what if i use the repeat you can see the repeat of the image of the image parts and uh, what if i use the stretch so you can see the image has been stretched so let me use as not a thousand it will exceed so it exceeded use 100 and you can see the stretch image has been stretched around the border and around the div in border so let me use the repeat okay let me give it as a value 200 so this is the 200 uh, repeat and if i use the round i'm just playing with it i'm nothing doing nothing now if i use the stretch okay so we are here and uh, as i uh, which i show you which i which was on the display at the start of the demo so that is our purpose uh, of the tutorial i hope you guys have learned something new today and uh, please uh, if you like my video click the like button and subscribe my channel and uh, leave your comment about the video thanks for now